Hello guys. <laughs> Brazilian. <laughs> So here we are on the Atomic Motorsports Audi S3. Now, a couple interesting things. This car is a hatchback, which we don't get in the US. It doesn't have, the US doesn't get these seats. What else don't we get? Man, a couple things. But other than that, so here we are. What did Atomic Motorsports do to the car? So here we have the Loba Big Turbo, it's a 40 mil. We have their proprietary ECU remap and TCU remap, which they do in-house, climate controlled, ambient controlled. So there is no mistakes. Um, you have H&R Sport Springs, lowers it just a tad bit, to be able to still drive on the Brazilian roads, which again, you know, there are nice roads that are paved, etc., nice, nice corners, stuff like that, but there are still some potholes, stuff like that. They don't want to hit speed bumps to control speed. <coughs> Excuse me. So you know, it's a it's a dailyable height, which this car is daily. Coming back to the big turbo, this car makes 420 horsepower at the motor and 400 foot pounds of torque. How crazy is that? Again, these EA AAA motors, they've been getting a lot, a lot of praise in the power department because over the last. Uh, 2.0 Gen 2 that came into GTIs, etc. They, you know, you had to be stage three to get any type of power. Let's do a little launch control. Excuse me, I'm a little, I have a little cold, so excuse the coughing and the nasally voice. But let's do a little launch control. ESC is off, track control is off. I'm in sport mode. My foot is on the brake. I'm gonna slam on the gas. It's gonna go up to 4,000 RPM and it's gonna fill the turbo up. You hear that? That's spinning all four wheels. How crazy is that? How crazy is that? And this car has an atomic motorsport downpipe only. So it's still very civilized to drive in town. There's no drone, there's no annoying exhaust noise, except for a couple, I wouldn't say annoying, but nice backfires after a nice couple hard drives. This is the Atomic Motorsport remap, so they do the ECU and TCU. So it shifts at 7,200 up here. Wow, this thing is fast, man. The shifts are super crisp, super clean. What you would expect from a DSG. You know, stock GTIs, what I noticed was there was some lag in there, so it's not that it's annoying, but you notice it. But this car especially does not have any lag at all. Power is very linear. The turbo, let's see when it actually, when we get full boost. I don't want to pull right here because there is a little police station, but I don't want to be that guy, but I'll be that guy right now. Alright, 4500 RPM, you get full boost. Fifth gear, still pulling hard. And that was a bump right there, it wasn't even that bad. We have worse roads in Miami. Man, this car is nice, Atomic really knows how to put a car, set a car up. That bump is a little hairy. But yeah, what can I tell you? The car brakes well, handles well, it's very flat. These chicanes I've been taking at a speed that you're not supposed to be taking them at. Very quick, very swift, yeah? And yeah, I would say only complaint, this would go to eight S3. Any new, relatively new car that across the board is the electronically power assisted power steering. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. That's, you know, you don't feel, you don't feel what you should feel. But I mean, it's very direct. If you're ever in Brazil and you need any tuning services or whatever you need, man, Atomic, they got you. They got you. And it's very hard to find good tuners that actually do custom maps. And, you know, I have not felt any type of hiccup or any hesitation on the car so you know that's another thing to note which actually puts them way ahead of the game in terms of tuning thank i want to say give a very special thank you to the guys at atomic 
we're still a small YouTube channel. We came here on a limb, see if we could drive one of their cars. They set us up with, if not the nicest car they have. And man, you know, nothing but thank you to them. We can only express our gratitude from everybody here at The Shift to the guys at Atomic. Thank you guys, thank you guys very much. And yeah, hope you guys, hope I catch you guys on the next one. Don't forget to subscribe, give us a like, leave us a comment, see what you think, give us some feedback. And yeah, thanks guys, cheers.